Are you diagnosed with diabetes? Do you remember a time before you had diabetes with all your great energy and you felt really good? Maybe you were at a younger age and you were exercising, right? You didn't have any of these symptoms. You didn't have any of these complications. I wanna tell you that 90 to 95% of those with diabetes is type two diabetes. And type two diabetes mainly comes from lifestyle choices that have kind of worked with your genetics to just kind of expose this symptoms of type two diabetes, if that makes sense, right? Because really type two diabetes is just a cluster of symptoms. And why are those symptoms there? You didn't just magically wake up with type two diabetes one morning, right? You didn't just magically get type two diabetes from someone else who had type two diabetes, right? It's not like a, a communicable virus, okay? It's these little symptoms that just started adding up and adding up and adding up throughout the course of your life. For some, it takes maybe five or 10 years. For others, it takes 20 to 50 years and they get it later on. And for others, we're seeing it at a younger and younger age, right? Where people in their 20s are developing type two diabetes. And it's not always the case where you're morbidly obese or, or even overweight, right? People who are thin and even look in shape can develop type two diabetes. So I want you to think back to before you had your diabetes. I want you to go back to when you weren't at the doctor's office, you weren't in the waiting rooms, you weren't on medication, you weren't spending money on all these co-pays. And I want you to know that you can go back to that. For many of you, you can go back to that, okay? With the right nutrition, with the right lifestyle changes, you can go back to that, okay? And I want you to imagine that. I want you to get that motivation to know it is possible to reverse your diabetes symptoms for a majority of you because a majority of you are type two diabetics, okay? And type two diabetes is a preventable disease. And even if you have type two diabetes, you can still reduce or eliminate your medication. You still can reduce or eliminate those diabetes symptoms, okay? So I wanna give you this message of hope. I wanna give you this message of some understanding that this doesn't have to be something you live with for the rest of your life. This doesn't have to be something that your family helps you kind of deal with and you feel like you're a burden on your family or friends or, you know, as you get older, you're like, it's only going to get worse and worse. It doesn't have to. Okay. So I want to give you this message. I want you to know you're powerful. You have the power to make changes and I want to give you something free to help you make those changes. If you click the link below, you can get this booklet. This is something I give to my patients all the time. It's a great start of understanding what to eat. So it gives you a great grocery shopping guide of the foods you need more of. It's also gonna tell you 101 foods you should avoid or stay away from, right? So whether you completely avoid them or you just reduce them, but you're understanding, okay, what foods do I eat more of? How do I go grocery shopping? and what foods to avoid. This is completely free. If you click the link below, you'll get this booklet for free. Because again, I'm here to help you. I'm here to help you understand what diabetes is and understand how my patients that I see are reversing their diabetes symptoms. So click the link below, share this with your friends and family who are struggling with diabetes or have just been diagnosed, or maybe they feel like they're getting worse after 20 years of having diabetes. Share this video with them, like the video and connect with us. And thank you so much for watching. I hope to see you again and have a wonderful day.